And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Fable 3 Traders Keep DLC. Make sure you hit that lap button, make sure you support button. Let's play some more Fable 3, hope everyone's enjoying this series. Let's go do some more gameplay. You know what, before we go in there, let's go and take a look at how much gold we have. Let's ah, see if we can get hello. up to that key. I don't think we can yet. But let's go ahead and look. Fancy a bit of counting. 500,000 now. Oh, oh, we're getting close. Can we get the key? Can we get the key? I don't think... Hey, we got the key! Now the sucky part now... We have the key up here. But the chest that's down there that's buried... Now we have to find a way to spin this gold on something. I'm actually going to let this keep filling up. I want to see how full it gets. And yeah, anyways, uh, let's get into gameplay of some Fable 3 Traders Keep DLC. Faraday had a remote factory he opened up to the public before things turned sour. Clockwork Island. It was quite a popular tourist attraction some years ago. Faraday's inventions have changed the world, but all he really wanted was to make people happy. Why was he locked up? Nobody really knows. Your brother said he was a danger to mankind. As for Faraday himself, all he would ever say is that he'd rather die than betray his creations. I used to queue up for hours when I was a child. to Clockwork Island. I am Huxley and I will be your guide. Please refrain from using obscene language in front of the children. Now, if you will follow me, we will begin the tour. Keep your belongings with you at all times and try not to stray from the group. Begin with what is yet to come. Astonish your senses, give flight to your fancy by stepping into the street of the future. I'm starting to wish I'd paid this place a visit while it was still open. Before you is an everyday Bowstone suburb, as it will be 15 years from now. Yes, the future is in our grasp. Please walk among the citizens of tomorrow. Share in their joy. Marvel at their superior well-being. You are so clever and so happy. In the world of tomorrow, there is no conflict, no jealousy, no selfishness. Thanks to science, people are finally happy. Faraday. 
I'm ready for you, your majesty. I am most ready. And if it is violence you seek, then violence you shall have. This is a security announcement to all our guests here today. Please take cover. The management accepts no responsibility for any mutilations, fatalities, or slight grazes. And now, presenting the latest in armed defense mechanisms, a round of applause for the Colin Mark II. The street of the future is going to be a dangerous place to live. I'm starting to see why your brother locked Faraday up. Come on, let's find him, shall we? Graveyard of the future. Look at this place. There's some sort of canal down there. Ready when you are, Your Majesty. We can safely say this isn't part of the tour. What are those? Insects? I have instructed my cleaning and repair crew to clear the canal of detritus. Now go no himself quite a fort We 
we're getting close. Faraday must be in that factory up ahead. Why can't you leave me alone? I will never do as you ask. Do you hear me? Never! What's he talking about? I'm not sure. Maybe he's finally lost what little reason he had left. Rulers may believe they can impose their will to their wish. But I was born to make dreams come alive, not to create death. You have already seen the weapons your brother forced me to make. But they shall never leave this island, and neither shall I. So that's why your brother had him locked up. You've come here for. Ah, oh, so clever and so happy. We could do this forever and ever. Must I turn more of my creations into monstrosities? Leave us in peace. I have a feeling these dogs aren't here to play catch with us. Bombs. Why am I not surprised? I've had just about enough of this. Whatever he believes, he's too dangerous. There must be some way through. Look how you corrupted my life's work. Haven't you seen enough? Perhaps you need more evidence. It is not for life to resist attempted murder. I think there's a way through the roof. Come on. Incredible news. I have received word that King Logan himself is planning to visit the island. He wishes to speak with me in person. No doubt to congratulate me on all the advances I have made and on transforming Bowerstone slums into a happy and productive place. I shall have to record a special welcome message for Huxley. Never so. 
Let's hope that's the last of them. This is it, the last factory. He has to be here somewhere. It was all just recorded messages. He's been playing with us. Is this the perfect soldier you wanted, Your Majesty? Well, you shall never have it. Well then, I'm ready. Your brother destroyed everything I cared for. You may as well kill me. We should take him back to the keep. We can take care of his wounds there. I'm not like my brother. You're safe now.
Thank you. I should not have judged you so hastily, Your Majesty. You have been through a lot, Mr. Faraday. But now that we know the truth, your life will return to normal. Very good. He will be released as soon as his wounds are healed. Just tell her what my men found out, Hobson. Why, it was a wholly collaborative effort. Without my supervision, who knows when... Just tell me. Of course, indeed. As you know, the second prisoner is the alchemist and alleged witch, Mary Godwin. A rather foul and malevolent woman, by all accounts. We have uncovered files on experiments so grotesque, I don't mind admitting I lost part of my supper while reading them. Get to the point, Hobson. Hmm, uh, yes. Well, it seems that before she turned to foul necromancy, she came from a well-to-do family. We believe she may be hiding out at her grandfather's long-abandoned and rather opulent estate. I have the coordinates. I'll wait for you at the pier. The sooner we capture this woman, the better. And I shall continue leading the investigation into General Turner. There really seems to be so little information on the man. It's as if he had taken his records with him. Bollocks. I don't mind admitting I'm rather looking forward to more action. Too many years sitting at a desk. The estate has been abandoned for years, but there are definite signs of life here. I think we've found Mary Godwin's hiding place all right. This place represents everything General Turner despises. Old money, aristocracy, nepotism. You may find when you meet him that you have something in common. You're both revolutionaries. Then why does he want me dead? You stopped being a rebel. You became queen.
No wonder Witchcraft Mary turned out the way she did. She probably threw up. I almost feel like they're watching me. Surprise. They're alone. Some sort of zoo, but who keeps cowboys? I never really believed those rumors about. <laughs> Witchcraft Mary has to be somewhere in this demented zoo. I'd heard her experiments involve electrical currents. They make good deterrents, too. We could use something like this at the keep. Let's go. There must be a way around them. It looks more and more like Mary swapped one prison for another. Except she's in charge of this one. Another of the rumors about Witchcraft Mary. Necromancy. I never thought there was any truth to it. Someone's definitely been digging up corpses, though. I'm not sure I want to know why. But I'm guessing this has something to do with it. This looks like a good place to stop. Make sure to hit that like button. I'll see you in the next video.